Welcome everybody to Andy and Richard's railway layout out in yonder ship. If you take a quick look around, you'll see a minuscule part of the rolling stock. Uh, class 20 there, a Mark II E and an inspection saloon. Uh, looking at the track, it's all code 100 Pico, nothing fancy. The underlay is Woodland Scenic stuff, which looks like this. It's quite flexible, it's a bit like a skin diver's outfit. Uh, the idea is to reduce the noise because it's running on plywood, half inch plywood and two by one inch bearers underneath. Nothing too fancy, but that's the way we like it. Over uh, yonder section here, this will be the station area, a three track station, terminus. Um, and looking at the main track itself, two separate tracks, we've got them as close together as we can without them actually, the two trains actually clashing on the way round so it looks realistic nice sweeping curves as you can see that's a 40 inch odd curve in the background so it looks like the trains run fairly prototypically rather than looking like they're bending in half all the time uh, this curve is around about a 34 inch curve radius I think and if we move all that clutter to one side we'll get some trains running and off we go first one is an American Union Pacific engine pulling a New York Central train uh, let's count on one two three four five six seven eight car train if we can get that moving uh, apply some DC power and here we go. 